Make sure you go join our group, Canon Gaming. Thank you guys so much for 600 members. Can we possibly hit 700? Welcome back to Canon Gaming. Today, we're going to be doing an Adopt Me Inventory tour. I know I do a lot of these, but today's one is different because, um, you know, I actually don't know why today's one's different. Um, it's, I just like filming these and you guys like watching them. So here we go. Before it gets started in this video, make sure you like, subscribe, and comment down below your rug's name if you want a chance to win a Neon Legendary. You can enter as many times as you'd like. And we will be doing that like announcement at 5,000. So I'm very excited for that. And that'll be crazy when we hit it. Anyways, let's go and get straight on into this because these videos do tend to be quite long. So um our first category is role play i don't have anything for role play i think you only get role play stuff if like you're working at a job um so i don't think it will like ever actually stay in your inventory if i'm being completely honest i feel like it's a little bit like useless but maybe that's just me <laughs> and then next i still only have my one pair of wings the um da vinci we oh natural wings um i put those on my dota bird and then we have our gifts i don't really have any two cool gifts um my rarest gift I probably own is a bat box. I think it's a pretty cool gift, and it came from Halloween 2020, so it's quite old um, at this point. I need to also get some scarecrow boxes before they leave the game. And then we also have 15 RGB boxes, which I'm trying to get to 25 of these because I do. I don't think I'll do like a full video opening these, but I would like to do like a short or something. I think that'd be cool. Um, also, I'm so excited because tomorrow's Halloween, and I really, I'd really appreciate it if you could comment down below what you guys think would be a cool Halloween video to do um, because I want to do something cool for like Halloween, you know? Um, but anyways, here are all of our gifts. If you guys have an offer for any of these, just let me know. I, um, am trading all of them, but I'm not trading more than one of any of them. Like, you could offer for one back box. You cannot offer for all four back boxes, but you could offer for one. Anyways, here, let's move on to toys. We got some cotton candy stands, a lot of grappling hooks. Um, I don't really have any two rare toys. We've got the bubblegum machine rattle. Um, you guys will have to let me know down below. What is your favorite toy in Adopt Me? I, I honestly just... I think a tombstone's gotta be my favorite. Um, halfway because of the rarity, and then halfway because it's just so cool. Or a candy cannon just because of the rarity. Um, and then we just got some more toys. I really don't have any too rare toys, but as always, which this is literally probably getting so annoying for like you people that watch my videos every day. Which if you're one of those people, I appreciate you. But as always, adopt me. When are you gonna add a candy corn? Catacorn, a catacorn, not a candy corn. A catacorn. I'd absolutely love if they added one because they're just so dang cute. Also, I'm very excited because the farm like theme is coming. I was really um excited for this because we were all wanted like the farm egg thing so I was excited that we're getting a farm thing and it looks really really cool we're getting like a tractor and like hay stuff so it looks uh, super cool um anyways oh my goodness it's two days and 22 hours that's so sad I literally don't have like any of the pets but that's fine honestly I feel like Halloween okay we'll play tile skip I feel like Halloween pets have not really been getting too rare the lava dragon's pretty rare but like I don't know anyways I'm going super slow but here are the rest of our toys if you have an offer for any of my toys I'm willing to trade them besides the catacorn rattle because I would like to keep it um forever so so to annoy all of you guys in these things i'm gonna play the tile skip really really quickly and oh my goodness i'm gonna have to play all by myself um i'm gonna play the tile skip really quickly and then i'm gonna go ahead and show you guys all of our vehicles which here are pretty much all of them but i do want to like show you guys some of them out because they are really cool i'm gonna take out some of the ones i don't usually show because i do usually show like the same three um i'm willing to trade all of my vehicles except for the evil unicorn cycle and the egg delivery machine i really like those two vehicles um but if you have an offer for any of the other ones just let me know down below um i do want to show you guys some of these but i'll i I want to play tile skip first, which I'll probably not get my very many candy because I'm playing all by myself. How I beat tile skip all by myself. I'm very happy about that. Anyways, um, comment down below. What's your login streak? My current one is 161. That is crazy that I've been logging out for 161 days. That's like a third of a year. That's like really crazy to me. Anyways, let's go on and show you guys some of the vehicles that I don't usually show you. Like the witch's car van. I feel like this is a really cool vehicle. Honestly, I feel like it's so underrated. Like this is so cool. Um, like with the potions on the top, it's really, really cool. Um, and the taxi, the taxi is honestly the stupidest thing I've spent Robux on. Like, I don't know why I spent 450 Robux on the taxi, but you know, it's, it's fine. Um, and the planet car is also another one I can show you guys. This one's really, really cool. I really like how this looks and it has like the different centers of the, um, planet. It's really cool. Um, but anyways, here again, if you missed it or all of my vehicles, and if you would like to offer for any of these, just let me know down below. And oh my goodness, we're so zoomed out now. Okay, that's a little too close. Um, anyways, let's move on to food. I've been trying to get some Asia potions. I currently have eight. Um, I really want to get make like a neon of one of the new farm pets, so I'll have to keep saving up. I'm gonna try to get to 20 age potions. I think I have um 
15 um through like all my accounts so yeah um i don't really have any like rare food i do have some moon pies um or moon cakes and just some more stuff so if you guys do have an offer for any of my foods you can obviously offer the all these potions are not for trade sadly but um you can offer for any of my other foods if you do have an offer now let's move into the strollers i feel like strollers are very underrated i feel like honestly everything's underrated besides the pets like i feel like <laughs> they should be worth more you know especially like strollers i feel like when they're like in updates and stuff they're so expensive so i feel like they should be worth more anyways the only stroller i'm not willing to trade is this one it's really really cute i really like the little lanterns on it and i just really like it i don't really know how to pronounce it but it's really cute um i also really like these Luna strollers they're also really cute with like the little lights glowing out of it they're really cute um i also like this ufo one this one's really cute i do think this comes from either the gifts i think it does come from the gifts um and then we do have the princess stroller, which I just think is so elegant and pretty. It reminds me, I don't really know what it reminds me of, but it's just so pretty and cute. Um, and then the last one that I want to show you guys um, is the magic moon stroller. It's really, really pretty as well. Um, I also do like the clam stroller. Um, oh my goodness, why are you not? Oh my gosh, it's so cute. I need to take this one out more. It is sadly untradeable. I think it came from that like ocean update. It wasn't like the ocean egg. It was like, um, like save the ocean update. I don't really remember. But anyways, those are all my strollers. I don't really have too many because i don't really collect them but if you guys would like to offer for any of these just let me know as always down below in the comments um so yeah i am going to try to reply to every single person's comments today so if you want to comment something i will do my best to reply to it um so anyways let's move on to pet wear pet wear i love pet wear i think it's just so pretty it just adds a special little touch to the pets so we'll start from the um bottom somebody did give a suggestion if you are at the bottom of this it will bring you to like where it is in the next section which is pretty cool anyways we got some yellow sneakers which are really cute honestly i feel like i feel like tooth would look really cute with some yellow sneakers let's put those on tooth um so yeah tooth is literally the oh my gosh that is really cute okay tooth is like sick and sleepy we need to go ahead and do some tasks on that but um let's and then we just got some more pet wear um nothing too crazy i don't really have any super rare pet wear um comment down below what is the rarest pet wear that you own i really don't own anything too rare i think it came from this thing that one clam stroller i think it came from this um update where you got the badge as well um we got some of these like flame pet wares are they all called flame yeah um and then yeah the only pet wear i'm not willing to trade away is is got to be the um bellflower hats the banana hats and um green beans crown which now green bean has a brother which is so cool and you guys had so many really cute names and i'm trying i still haven't decided on one i think some of my favorites have got to be um I really like somebody said green tea matcha like you guys gave like really cute names um so yeah now for the moment you guys have all been waiting for the pets um i know this video is gonna be very long but that's okay um you guys always do seem to really like these adopt me inventory tours and they're really fun for me to film and i just honestly i did not know what to post today and i'm really stressed because i want to have like a cool video for tomorrow because it's halloween i'm also gonna make halloween's video tonight because i want to celebrate halloween you know um anyways uh let's go into pets so we got the sad a mole um which is so cute i love this little pet um i always do kind of take out like the same few pets so i'm gonna try to take out some different pets for today i feel like i take out a lot of my comments so i'm gonna take try to take out some more like rares and stuff i did recently get this ghost if you guys will go watch the video yesterday's video you'll see how i got this ghost i did get this neon ghost yesterday and i kind of don't want to trade it away but i mean we have to for the challenge um so i always kind of show you guys a lot of my um common pets i'm gonna try to show you guys more of like the uncommons rares and like so on um but yeah, we do have a lot of neon comments. I'm really trying to make a lot of neon megas because they're just so cool and they're really fun and easy to trade. Um, so yeah, we've got so many pigeons. I remember I spent like, I don't even know how much money. I spent so much money to open 50 urban eggs and I didn't get one single legendary and I was so mad. I just got a thousand of these rock pigeons. Like literally out of 50 eggs, I got 11 rock pigeons. That's crazy to me. Um, and then we've got some more pets. I still need to give the, the winner their neon a raccoon um it's like a whole process i'm trying to figure out how to friend them but it's like not working for some reason like when i friend them it says pending but they friended me and theirs is also pending so it's weird i don't get it and anyways we got a lot of pumas i was so excited because i really want to make a mega neon puma um and then we've got the babies of my inventory the meerkats we got the like legendary best pet in the game meerkat uh, um nibbles and then we got to the little uh we got that little triplet of butter the og cookie if you guys 
guys have watched my very like from the beginning guys and low cookie was my very first meerkat and then we got biscuit over here and those are just like the little trio we also have a neon a mega neon kieran which um i think is just so cool i really like how these look and i'm i feel like this is like a preppy pet so i could get some like preppy good trades um i just haven't like been sealing too many trades lately i've honestly not been like super active in adopt me lately um because we've been doing like um stuff for halloween so yeah anyways let's just move on we got some more pets um i honestly feel like the dolls were also super underrated like i feel like nobody talks about the dolls nobody ever trades for the dolls i don't know i feel like they're really cool and i think it's like a cool little addition to adopt me um anyways we got some more pets um uh, as i said in the last video i just i'm not a fan of camels i think they're really cute but like i don't know i feel like camels i i don't know i just really don't like when somebody trades me a camel they're so hard to trade um and then we got the butter birthday butterfly, which is just so pretty. I think all the butterflies, literally every year, they get prettier and prettier. Like, look at those wings. They're just so pretty. I love how there's, like, the two layers of wings. It's really pretty. Um, um... And then we've got our neon tarsier. I think I'm saying that right. It's really cute. I love this neon color. It's so gorgeous. And now let's keep moving on into the pets. Also, we have some toy poodles. I really like the toy poodles. And I feel like they're just, like, so cute. They have, like, little bangs. And it's really cute. Um, I also really do like the undead elks. Um, they're really, really cute. And this one's named Lavender Haze. At the moment, um, I do want to give, like, a little disclaimer. I am not trading any of my pets. And I... I'm sorry if you're mad about that. The reason why is, yes, like, some of my pets are for trade, but it's kind of hard to, like, be on each individual pet and say, this is for trade, this isn't for trade, and I feel bad, like, declining people's offers, so I'm sorry. At the moment, I'm not going to be trading any of my pets because I, I like all my pets right now, and I feel really bad, like, declining people's offers, so I'm just not going to trade them <laughs> from the start, but if you would like to offer for any of my other things besides pets, feel free to. I'm just not trading in my pets. Anyways, we got um, a little brownie over here. Um, I feel bad saying that, but I just, I don't know, I don't want, I feel worse, like, being like, I'm sorry, I'm not trading my pets, or, like, declining your all guys' offer, because I'm a very, like, picky person, and I don't, like, if I have one of the pets, then I wouldn't want to trade, even if it was an overpay, I wouldn't want your trade, just because I'd rather have one of that pet than two of a pet that I already have, if that makes sense. Anyways, next we got Brownie, and then just some more pets, we got Rudolph, the red-nosed reindeer, which, is oh my goodness, this is gonna be so cool for Christmas, I need to get an Arctic reindeer before Christmas, um, but yeah, we got some more pets, um, we've got our ostrich, we got grape, um, oh my goodness, I forgot about this little neon monkey, it's so cute, um, so yeah, anyways, let's just keep looking at these pets, we've got, I also really... I also think the goldfish is another really, really cute pet. Um, Treasures of Ruin. <laughs> I think that you can still... Oh, my goodness. There's kind of like a little ombre on the little pet. That's cute. I think you can still get this at, like, the pool party thing. And it's really cool. Um... I also love the giant ant eater how it's like little tongue just sticks out it's really cute um so here it is i think this was like 100 robux i really love when they do like kind of cheap robux pets because um i feel like a lot of people can't really afford to do the thousand robux pets so when they do like those little ones um it's really nice oh i forgot i had a ghost dog so that's nice so i don't need to buy ghost dog you just gotta buy like every other pet i think those dogs are really really cute and i know that they did this with the ghost where they did like the whole pet as megan Neon, but i feel like the ghost dog also would have just looked so cute i think it's only the eyes and nose that glow and i feel like it would just would have looked so cute if the whole thing glue but i guess the ghost already had that so yeah and then we got the fish um i have no clue where this comes from oh my goodness i never realized that i thought it like stood up like this but it stands up like it just looks like a normal little fish it's so cute um a new addition to our collection is evie red velvet i have really bad name coming up with because i want to name it like i want to name it evie and i also want to name it red velvet so i was like okay evie red velvet um okay we're going kind of slow we also have our mega bird of paradise which oh my goodness i just love this pet so much and as much as i want to trade this away and see what offers we could get i don't think i could get myself to trade this because it's just so cute in my opinion um we also got the toasty red panda i really love the toasty red pandas i think they're just so cute and definitely my favorite pets from the little um lures i think i even like it more than the blazing lion obviously i still really want a blazing lion but it's really cute um and now we also got a sheep which i think this came at the same thing as the fish i don't really know when they came but i do think that those came at the same time we also have a ride red squirrel named sandy oh i love that it's really really cute and i really like how its little tail just like moves back and forth um and then we also have a ram i think the rams are also really really cute pets um so yeah also uh guys save your money up because the farm thing is coming in two days and 22 hours so um save your money up because i'm pretty sure that those are all going to be bucks 
Um, I'm sure it's going to be two Buck Pets and then one Robux Pet, but I don't know. Um, this is also another really underrated pet, the Manny Mackerel. I feel like these weren't, like, a lot of people didn't really get this because they were quite expensive for an Ultra Rare, and I feel like Ultra Rares are very, like, overlooked. Um, but anyways, we also do, I did also get a Magma Moose. I got this recently, if you saw. I think I did a short on it, but I did get a Magma Moose, and I also have the Magma Snail, so the only one that I'm missing is the, um... Oh my goodness, I feel like there's a fourth pet besides the Blazing Lion. Is there not? Is there only the three pets in the Blazing Lion? I don't know. You guys have to tell me no. I feel like there's another pet, like another Ultra Rare in the Blazing Lion, but I don't know. And then, um, oh, I forgot we had a Hydra. I love Hydra so much. I need to change its name. That's not a good name. Um, and then let's move on to this one. We got white chocolate over here. I love white chocolate. Well, you also recently did get a Zodiac Minion Egg, which is really cool. I love collecting like old eggs that are out of game. Um, and now we're in the legendaries. We have the Winged Horse, which is actually the very first pet that you want to you guys gave me was a winged horse and i thought that was just really cool and honestly i will never trade this and i always cherish this pet um we also do have our neon turtle lemon lime another little thing that i don't like if i've had it in my inventory for more than 20 minutes i'm not trading it <laughs> unless it's part of like a trading challenge i'm not trading it so i don't think i can trade lemon lime away i've gotten really attached to it and nobody's offers that i've got have barely been good so i haven't been like wanting to trade it away you know um and then we also have some tree kangaroos which are just absolutely adorable like the cutest little pets is so cute and then we have our strawberry turkey bat dragons which i do want to get some more of these little guys because they're really really cute um i have three right now so i'm not complaining but i'd always love to get some more i also do have one single snow owl i literally had like 50 of these but i traded them a lot away um and then we've got the Nessies. Okay, so this is the one that I still need a name for. Um, I think, honestly, I really kind of like green tea and celery stick. Honestly, I don't really know between this two. You guys have to let me know. Would you, which one do you, would you guys choose? Green tea or celery stick? Because I really like both those names. And then we have the king of our inventory. We've got green bean over here, which it does have bingo on it right now. Because um, a lot of people are asking about that. Why do I have bingo to my names? It's actually for <laughs> these thumbnails. Because I'll name, I have so many favorite pets so it's hard to like show you guys them all so what i do is actually just type in bingo which they're not all favorited right now because i usually change the name after and it usually pops up like all of my like best pets so um it's just easier to take the thumbnail if that makes sense anyways we got green bean out here who green nessies are just so cute and i'm i'm like sad but happy with the value of nessies because i'm happy that they have good value but i'm also sad because i would want a thousand nessies um and then we've just got some more pets. Um, I really also like the ice golems. I think they're really awesome looking pets. And it's so weird because it definitely looks like purple. And then when you take it out, it's like blue. I think the purple, like, it would have looked a little bit cooler if it had, like, the purple instead of the blue. But I think it's really cool how it's, like, a see-through blue. It's really cool. Um, and then we also got which considered to be the best pet of my entire inventory for Rusty Frostbite, which we got from our Dog to Frost Dragon Challenge. If you guys have not seen that, go check it out. I am going to do a Dog to Owl, but it's one of those challenges that I need inspiration to do and i just don't have inspiration to be do a bunch of training right now so that will come out when it comes out um but here's frosty frostbite we also have our mega dota bird of fruit cups another little icon in our inventory i think it's so cool and i really like um how its little nose glows up it's really cute we also have midnight dark crow um which is like perfect for the halloween spirits i definitely think that the crow would have fit the um halloween update so well like <laughs> instead of the farm egg but it's also it's i don't really care it's still really cute pet and then um we've got rainbow freeze who this is what that um little bell hat is reserved for it's really really cute and she's definitely i just love flying on this because i'm sorry we're not gonna play with my game uh, i love flying on this just because it just glides so easily and it's a really fun pet to fly on but it's really cute and yeah and then we also of the very top pets in our inventory is a white chocolate our albino gorilla and that's who the little banana hats for and this is a really cute pet honestly i don't really know the value of a albino gorilla i feel like they are worth like i don't really know i would say neon legendary but I also feel like they're not worth like Neon Legendary. Maybe like the value a little under like a Nessie is probably what these are worth. I don't really know. I also did end up getting another Aussie egg. So I have two now. I'm going to get to like where I have 100 Aussie eggs. Just wait and see. And then here are all of our favorites. These are pretty much all of the pets I've gotten since coming back to Adopt Me. So in 161 days. So pretty much all of the pets that I have are from 161 days because my best of pets were sadly hacked. But you know what? I'm fine with that. I feel like. We've made so much progress since being hacked, and I'm very, very happy with our 
thing. So <laughs> I don't really know what I'm saying. Anyways, I really hope that you guys enjoyed today's video. And I will see all you amazing people next time. Um, And also, I would appreciate if you give this video a like. And while you're at it, make sure to comment or like, subscribe, or comment down below your username. If you want a chance to win any on Legendary, you can enter as many times as you would like. And I'll see you all my people tomorrow for Halloween. Well, bye.